Carolyn Blackburn shows us it's not what you expect. In a dimly lit basement in Wilkes-Barre, artist Boyd is making something truly remarkable. This machine has been a godsend. Using a digital magnifier, he has the power to paint what he sees in his imagination, something some people might take for granted. I was officially declared really fine in 2012. Rob was 48 years old when his vision began to drop to 300 over 20. He developed what's called ischemic optic neuropathy because of unmanaged type 1 diabetes. But through it all, Rob still saw a reason to believe in himself. When I lost my eyes didn't mean I lost my mind or I lost my intelligence so that people with disabilities can still do something amazing. Before Rob was blind, he never even picked up a paintbrush. But now, since March of this year, he's made more than 90 paintings. He says he's been inspired by TV show host and painter Bob Ross. I started watching. I said, this gives me a sense for my own mental health, my own spirit. And the rest is history. It's, it's taken on a life of its own. And through his artwork, he's bridging a divide between sighted and non-sighted people. It has my name and it has my shop. It has the logo, the beauty name. Rob is also welcoming newcomers with his paintings. The owner of Healthy Hair Beauty Salon moved to Wilkes-Barre six years ago from the Dominican Republic. This painting meant the world to her. I'm so happy when I saw the painting with my logo and saying, go straight to Alex. That, was, that, that means a lot. We need to show each other compassion. We need to realize that nobody here is free of struggle. For information about Rob's artwork, visit our website, WNEP.com. Carolyn Blackburn, Newswatch 16, Wilkes-Barre.